What's up with gluten? Okay, um, yeah. And it says your this book is dedicated um, to my family. Gavin, thank you so much for all your love and um, support and for the efforts that you constantly put into my company. I couldn't do it without you. Jeff, you are my gentle giant. You constantly show me the softer side side than life. You have helped me immensely in bringing this book to print. Or Tara, um... My sweet angel, or or my sweet sweet angel, you are an inspiration behind so much that I do. Okay, and so these are the pages right here. What's up with gluten? A chef's perspective um, from my kitchen to yours. Order is in the way. Uh, I will go for the content. Okay, let's start with the first page. January 3rd slash 2000 and or slash or January 3rd slash 2009 we went back to work my mind finally made up that I was going to that I was going to stop catering and focus my energies and helping people through food I am a big time foodie taste and text um, and texture is everything to me. I want to give people that were, um, deep right the um, great food to have it, too. So, the journey began in search of creating the best possible food to offer. I had to go back to the drawing board and rewrite all my recipes. To be gluten-free, that challenge had many highs and lows. What about, or what a blast I was having. Every time I had a winner in the test kitchen, I would um, force all my staff to taste the food ex or exclaiming, taste it. Yeah, they never know it's gluten-free. I had said that. So many times that my staff said we just have to name the product yet they never know so hence the trademark so hence the trademark was born yet never know. Okay, um in this book I would like to share with you all the great recipes that have been created with you, the reader in mind. Don't be afraid to experiment. If you don't like a particular um, ingredient in the recipe, switch it up and make the recipe your own. I have included blank note pages in the book for you to do just that. A recipe is nothing more than someone's the idea happy cooking and that's always happy and that's always happy eating okay um no what okay thanks
fiber is it a challenge jump for celiac them along with fruits and vegetables them the most common sources of dietary um of fiber are whole grain them bread then cereals and but people on gluten free diets um cannot simply go to the supermarket and buy ready made um the whole grain products the majority of um packaged um high fiber products contain gluten not surprisingly metal research or medical research shows them that people on them um, gluten free diets them tend to eat tend to tend to eat um been the uh, equate uh, um, amounts of fiber. Okay, so I'll skip that part right here. Um, uh, okay, seafood. Seafood is one of the best um, sources of protein because it's usually low in fat. Fish, such as the salmon, or such as salmon, is a little higher in fat. But it is the heart healthy kind. The Mamiga. Um, the free fatty um, bases. Okay. Guys, when when you're reading this some page, this will show you the concept. Then I think I will have a link for that down in the video. The description below on YouTube. Anyways, if you guys have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, hit that notification bell right next to the subscribe button. I want to thank you so much for watching, guys. And let me know what you think down below of what you think of this book.